from up in the clouds, which you could from Wimsy Rainbow Star, and we are back with Bandit at 2. So we're on to the chapter, the Lumen Sage. And we just defeated Alrane. I don't remember. Um, and we got Alruna the weapon, which looks really cool, and I would like to try it out. Hopefully I get the chance to, without having to go immediately into a boss fight. I probably will. So yeah. Um, I literally picked up from where we left off in the last episode. So, why is a horse? Oh, you know what? This is one of her Oh god, it's one of these... Fucking just like the. <sighs> All right, use Diomedes. Is that how you pronounce that? I don't know. It looks like a Greek god kind of name. To hurry to Loki, or maybe it's Diomedes. I don't know. Okay, climax horse, really. All right, what am I looking? Lock on, evade. I'm gonna climax controls. This is the same thing. Oh, whatever. What? Okay. Did I need to calibrate it? Okay. Cool. Whoa. Am I- I'm not even- I'm not actually moving him, am I? Well, okay, side to side. Elbows up, side to side. <laughs> Elbows up, side to side. Sorry. Okay, enough of that. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just, like, attacking shit. And am I even getting, like, a combo or what? I- I don't know what I'm doing. Wait, is- so is this the demon that she uses to, like, slice the shit out of stuff? I really don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm I'm just why do I keep like climaxing this weird. Oh, is that Gamora? Jesus. I okay, so I've played the first chapter of this game several times just Well I fell off. That's cool. Uh just to practice. Do I have to start all over? I don't know. Um, yeah, this guy this guy's fast. I think I did have to start all over, that sucks. Um maybe not. Um it, it breaks my heart every time I have to fight Gamora. I'm so like, <laughs> oh no, I dodged. Fuck. I guess not. Okay. So yes, I do need to turn him and stuff. So oh yeah, I can jump too, huh? Oh fuck. Ow. Um. Uh. <laughs> okay. I, I, do I have to break stuff? I don't know. This is confusing and sudden. And I, please don't make me start all over, because that would suck. I'm on a spine, it looks like. Oh my god, and there's like blood? Every, I don't know. What's- oh, wait, what the hell? Oh, it's one of these guys. Okay, fuck you. I, I don't know if my slashing is doing anything. Oh, now it will, because it's like, oot. And he accumulates magic as I go, so, or as he goes. Or, uh, rock flying at my face! Oh my god! Pretty cool though, like, of course. I mean, it, it's not like the motorcycle chapter wasn't cool, it was just aggravating. What am I jumping on? What the fuck am I jumping? Okay, that thing. This is a long, snaky, like, spinal cord. What the heck was this beast? Yeah, Inferno is like crazy looking in this game. I think I should be dodging these, not blading them. Oh, there's a boss monster? What? I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, there's two boss monsters. Cool! I would be heavy. Wait, did I actually dodge correct successfully? Um, I don't know. <laughs> I got a silver. I don't know what I'm doing. Turn. Pivot. Loki, can you not keep having the? <sighs> Whoa, that was cool. Just like horse blade thing. <laughs> oh my god. Baldur, stop. Can we talk, please? <gasps> Wait. The fuck? Oh god, we're fighting on the back? Really? And I'm holding Loki. Baldur, I get that you're pissed. I get it, dude. I'm sorry. Oh, Jesus. If that was in 3D. <laughs> wow. <laughs> nice. It's weird, though, because that's her dad, and she's just like... Badge in face. I mean, I know that's how Amber would fight, but it's like. This is awkward. Serious! Oh, bats! So, question. If I hadn't learned the ability by now. I don't know why I'm talking so loud, sorry. If I had learned the ability by now, would I have learned it now? I think I'm talking. It sounds loud because it's bouncing off the Wii pad and I'm getting. Yeah? <laughs> no! No! Sorry, I didn't want to do that. I didn't want to. Keep playing. Keep, keep playing. I tapped it. I didn't mean to. 
Panther. Wolf. I love that he turns into a wolf. It's so cool. Keep interfering. He still owes me some answers. <laughs> like, he looks pretty badass as a wolf. Like, that's so fucking cool. Like, Lumen Sages, it would be really cool to have, like, a game about one of them or something like that, you know? Because they're, they're pretty neat, too, like... Your impudence will cost you your life, witch. Oh, he has a clock, too. So you're saying diplomacy has failed, then? <laughs> diplomacy has failed. <laughs> Surrender, or it will be more than your mask that you lose. I have to fight him again. Witch. Or shall I call Bayonetta? That Bayonetta. seems to be what people call me these days. Very Except well, then, Bayonetta. You shall be the first umbral witch to die at my hand. First. At least there's that. Yes, we know he's Baldur. We know. We know. We fought him before. We did. I swear it on my honor as a lumen sage. Yeah, it's just really cool how there's like so many similarities between them and the witches. It's really just what side they're on and who they summon for help. And then, of course, like, the little angelic aesthetics and whatnot, but it's like... We have, like, the same skill set, man. We turn into animals. Damn it! Fuck. Okay, bad. We turn into animals, we have, like, wings and shit. We have the... the time... crap. Whatever. <laughs> Sorry, I'm, like, trying to concentrate and talk at the same time. It's not working. Um, but like, yeah, like their skill sets are very similar, which is really cool. Like, but it's like, one's quote unquote good, one's quote unquote evil. Honestly, though, I think they're probably all just neutral. Really, like Bayonetta, she, you know, she can summon demons and stuff. I don't think she's evil, like she herself, you know. And I don't think Baldur's evil either. He's just pissed. I, I don't blame him for being pissed. Like that sucked. You know, like he got. Like that was that that was shitty what happened to Rosa. But then I don't know what's actually up with Loki, you know, like what the deal there is. So Damn it, I'm dodging! I swear, I'm not trying to be dumb. I love how his health bar is like fancy like feather looking stuff. It's funny though because in the first game, I, I don't mind fighting Balder in the end because he did kind of do douchey stuff. But I wonder what reason he did it for. What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? Jesus. Like that. Like, just like. I will admit, though, um, as, like, aside from the whole Balder thing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> um, the. I didn't expect the demon who took Jean to get killed so quickly. But then I'm guessing she's not the big focus, maybe? Because now she's the fucking whip. <laughs> so, um,. Unless something happens later and, like, she breaks out of it or some shit, I don't know. But, like, um, I am doing terribly for- No! Get out of your bird form. I don't want that. It's not useful right now. At least I don't think. Um. Like, what was I saying? Oh yeah, the opponent. But yeah, there might be something bigger going on just with the balance of things, you know? Because that's what's, what's happening. But maybe this- I don't know, like, I wonder what the connection is with- with Jean getting taken and then with what's going on. Like she said about bad stuff happening to our world and all that. We'll see. You know. Oh, my ear it just no. <laughs> oh, oh god, oh god. What? Wait, what just happened? That was weird. Ow, I'm kidding. Oh, also, you guys, um, I didn't mean to, like, I, when I went back through old chapters, I found stuff that I had not come across originally when I was playing uh, while recording. God, I'm um, so I, if you, if you can notice, my HP bar is bigger. <laughs> I found a couple witch hearts. I also discovered. Hang on. I also discovered that. Damn, he's pissed. Like, she could try to grab that. This, this is impossible. <laughs> Little one. Uh oh. Well, 
Where am I? Lady Nether! Get, get, get away from me! Did you turn blue? <gasps> How? How is that a platinum? I got hit so many times. How did I get platinum? Holy crap. I'm gonna keep going though. How did I get platinum, you guys? You saw how many times I got hit. I I don't even. I don't even. <laughs> um, what I was going to say is, uh. What was I gonna say? Fuck. Um, oh, yeah, I. What? Wait a minute. Uh. Um. <laughs> can you explain this to me? <laughs> okay, I'm really confused. Uh. Vigor in the city of deja vu. I think we'd all like to. Well, I'd like to. You guys already probably know what's going on, because. Yeah. I'm just like, this is the like first chapter of the first game. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm just like, what? <laughs> Whoa, boot to the face. But yeah, I was saying something and I don't remember. Now. Okay, are we doing like some crazy time traveling shit right now? Because oh my god. The, oh oh god, wait. I know where oh. this is. I know when this is. Yeah. Oh god. Oh, this is cool. Okay, before we do anything, hold on. Wait, that's the wrong thing. Um I wanna check out Dare Whip. And I can't equip it to the feet, right? Oh, I can! Wait, then what's the alternative? Dude. Oh, this is so cool looking. It looks awesome on her uh, feet, too. Dude, this is super cool. Oh my god, that looks awesome, you guys. I freaking love it. Dude, this is so awesome. I kind of want to use this, but like, I don't know. Well, let, let's let's stick with this for a little bit. Okay, so, dude, I'm freaking tripping out right now. Vigrid? Wait, hold on. Anything over here? I, I want to be thorough because I fucking missed up, you guys. I can't. Okay, no, I can't. Go the red looks so fucking cool, dude. Oh, that would look. Dude, wait. I just saw a. Check. Sky obviously blazed red. Could there have been a fire? <laughs> it's hard to believe at first, but it seems like I returned that dreaded moment in time 500 years ago. I think I know exactly what moment. Um, these would look so cool with her first game costume. Am I right? Okay. Um, she just beat the shit out of every. Jeez, the range. What is the range on this stuff? It looks. That's jumping. Damn, what did I even just do? Oh my god, this is super cool. Um, I never got the whip weapon in the first game, but I think it's just because I'm dumb. <laughs> I missed, like, a ton of shit. I'm sure if I went back and- which I'm still gonna go back and, like, do other stuff, but I wanna play through this one. Okay, can they- they can't see me, right? Those are witches. Okay. Cause they look- it's funny, the, the female witches look- er, female witches, wow. The witches look like uh, ninjas in their costumes. They remind me of ninjas. Okay, I don't need to go to Rodan's shop. But wait, we're in the past. What does it look like? Right? Oh my god, these are so cool! Dude, I love it! Oh my god. Oh, that's right, I purchased the alternative. I'm stupid. Being a demon lets me read minds. You're so you're still here? It's like not. My halo. I guess it's just because of the Let's game. Do. All right. How... <laughs> well, I might as well just buy the alternatives for all these, right? So I don't have that though. That's probably that. Um, 
the LP I couldn't get last time. I'll go back and try to get it. Not right now, but like later. Dude, I'm like, this is like super cool right now. Oh my god. Jesus. Oh my god. Oh, she still uses the guns. Okay, that's... I learned that if you hit uh, the... the Sorry. Uh, the dodge button and like hold down one of the attack buttons at the same time it does like crazy shit but it's not really battle efficient too much i've noticed like i, I kind of get hit a lot when i do that okay so is there anything down this way aside from oh there is yeah because i'm like this is where you come from in the first game uh when you're in bigger obviously because that's where you're in in the first game yeah this is the thing that goes down Alright, what's this? Damn. Ha! Huh. She's just standing there like completely like mostly naked. Oh god, it's even the old fashioned fucking Oh no! It's these dicks! Oh god. I'm probably gonna get terrible combo points though with all this weaponage. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. I'm like going nuts with Oh my god, even the old torture attacks is hilarious and kind of horrible. Whatever, these guys fucking earned it. It just... Hey, it was 777 for a sec. That's awesome. It seems like, why does it seem like she's like undoing the attacks every time? Oh, because I'm supposed to... I don't know. What am I doing? Is that, oh, is it because I was holding it? Is that why? I don't know. I'm still holding the button because I'm used to, like, how the guns work. Gee, that took a while. Oh! Hee <laughs> I like these things. Okay, cool. Ah, oh, this is so cool, you guys. This is super cool. Okay. So, uh, I came from those doors, that's right. Okay. Hang on. I know, I'm, like, being really, like, lame and slow about grabbing everything, but I want stuff. I really don't need any more, uh, Healy items, though. Oh, is that a book? Oh, yeah, books. Okay, I forgot. I have, like, books that I haven't read yet. Or pages or whatever. I don't know. Grab it. The Fountain Square. Shadows on Vigorid. Wait, how- How are his books in the past? I'm really confused. Okay, I'll read a couple things and then I'll have to end the episode, but I'm, I'm excited for what's to come. Oh my god. Like, holy shit. Okay. What's this? An unknown entrance? So I must have found this in the first two chapters. Have you ever heard of gates that connect worlds? It might sound like strange fiction, but the truth is in these, these gates exist all over the world we live in. The gates that connect the three worlds and makes the foundation of our own is relatively well known. So if you're reading this, I'll just go ahead and assume you know of it. However, there are stories of doors that lead to the secret layers of the supernatural. And I've got a great source who just gave me the information I need to bring things to light. I, don't know. I can't reveal who my source is, but according to them, there's a gateway that leads to a primordial world cut off from the flow of time, a place called Muspelheim. Ah, the place is full of demons, angels, witches, and sages who spend their days pursuing nothing other than battle. This limitless world disregards the wounds and deaths of yesterday, always breathing life into its warriors so that they may live to fight another day. Interesting. You know the stories about some guy who just suddenly disappears, is gone for months, then reappears out of thin air as if nothing ever happened? There's a large probability that guy accidentally stepped into a Muspelheim and somehow found his way back. That sounds like... shitty. I know it's the job of a journalist to explore and uncover the truth behind rumors like these, but as far as traveling to other dimensions in a state of endless war, I think I'm good for now. Yeah. Alright, so what's the one we just picked up? It was... Shadows... something? Yeah. I'll get to all the other ones, I just forgot to check them. The witches are gone from this universe. They were said to there's a cat that was They were said to have been killed off, but one by one during the malicious witch hunts that once spread through Europe. At least that's what's written in the books. The real truth is a little more complicated. The mass slaughter known as the witch hunts of Vigard was, in truth, a war of mythical proportions. The Lumen Sage responsible for the war launched a conflict that expanded beyond just humanity, reaching into Inferno and Paradiso as well. The angels hold on. The angels' offensive was so overpowering that the Umbral were completely wiped out, but in the aftermath, this destructive fate also met the Lumen, and both clans were wiped from history. As I researched the Umbral and Lumen, who are considered the overseers of history, I learned that what we see with our eyes and hear with our ears isn't always the truth I thought it to be. 
an umber witch who survived the witch hunts of the past. What sort of monumental secrets are locked away in her destiny? They unfold even now in the unending cycle of life and death. Crazy to think that something that could decide the fate of the universe is taking place in Noah's end at this very instant. At least that's what my instinct's telling me is happening. I'll use this prized nose of mine to sniff out whatever is actually going on. Alright. So in the next episode, we're going to keep conti uh, keep continuing. Wow. We're going to continue to check out uh, Vigrid, apparently. Thank you guys for watching. This is going to be a crazy ride, uh, I think. Check the annotations at the end and the links in the description below. And I'll see you guys next time. And until then, stay with me.